Lanthanum hexaboride, LAB6, is an inorganic chemical compound comprised of the rare earth element lanthanum and boron. This refractory ceramic material exhibits interesting properties, including a very high melting point, 2210 degrees Celsius, hardness, and thermal conductivity, combined with low work function and low thermal expansion. It is notable for its metallic luster and deep black color. LAB6 is frequently used as a thermionic emitter, due to its capacity for emitting electrons when heated. This low work function property makes it suitable for application in electron microscopes and electron beam lithography systems. Its stability at high temperatures and resistance to attack by oxygen also make it useful for these applications. Its performance as an electron emitter often surpasses tungsten, which was traditionally used in these applications, by producing a brighter, more coherent electron beam with a longer working life. LAB6 has also found use as a size-slash-strain standard in X-ray powder diffraction due to its crystalline nature. Its distinctive diffraction pattern makes it useful in calibration routines for these instruments. Its high melting point and hardness have also seen LAB6 used in specialized industrial applications. These include parts for high-performance vacuum systems, welding electrodes, plasma devices, and high-intensity lighting technologies. In recent years, its use in certain cutting tools has been investigated due to its hardness, though the brittleness of the material has so far limited this application. Lanthanum hexaboride has also been studied for potential use in hydrogen storage due to the boron content, but as of my knowledge cutoff in September 2021, this has remained a largely experimental area of research. The high cost of LAB6 relative to other materials has also tended to limit its applications to those where its unique properties confer a distinct advantage. Please note that, while LAB6 has some fascinating properties and uses, it should be handled with care as with all chemical compounds. While it is generally stable, it can react with strong acids, and powdered forms can be harmful if inhaled, ingested, or if they come into contact with the skin or eyes.